Is it called? Is it right. called Showdown? Showdown, Showdown Sunday. Sunday, bro. Yeah. But I'm gonna I'm gonna roll into some packs first to get it warmed up. No, this is the first video. This is the first video that we are going to be doing highlights for, and then the the what's to look for to round one of, of our FIFA journey of this game. All right. Yeah. I think well, that's the best way to do it. Yeah. When we have a first Super Sunday and I slap you. Fuck off. You're not going to slap me, mate. There's a record against me in FIFA 22. It doesn't matter about FIFA ah. 22. It's all about the new game. It doesn't ah, matter. Yeah. Look, you look back on history and <laughs> think, it, oh, I'm all mighty in glory. <laughs> but, mate, you watch this team. Telling you, it's got it's it's got its heads pulled in. You're gonna have your five at the back. We let our we let our three nil game go, but we we you know we welcomed each other back as a team. We've got the team motivation again, and we're thinking, all right, let's look forward to the weekend, get the shit game out of the way, and then we can slap your ass and send your boys back home. All right. Because you guys can't do it on a cold night in Stoke. <coughs> we'll see about that. We'll see about that one. <laughs> None of this is rehearsed, by the way. No, it's not. This is just we, we a do good not old have laugh. A, have a plan of, yeah. This is a good old laugh. Jacob, what do you think on how do you think your team's going to perform this weekend? Have, has your preparation over the summer? Do you think it's going to deliver this weekend? Yeah, I reckon the new signings, such as Benzema at the moment, uh, the way the team's performing, especially Origi coming off the bench. I think they'll be uh, a great addition to the team, especially the way Origi's been playing off the bench at the moment. Uh, the boys need a little bit of a kicking in the attack, but should be all good for the game. Now, you guys got a new, new stadium. You're at the London Stadium this year. Um, do you think that's going to add some pressure towards the players and you know, for you and your staff? Uh, I reckon it will be, uh, probably will be a bit of pressure on the pl players, especially for the fans too, playing at such a bigger stadium that we originally were. But uh, it should be, it should be good. It should be a lot of fun. Um, should get some wins in there. Um, first game should be a definite win in front of the fans. Who, who's, who are you trying to eye out for the opposition this weekend in particular? Okay, so trying to eye out uh, Quadrado for <laughs> this weekend. Um, I'm pretty sure he'll probably give us a pelting in, in attack, especially when we're on, uh, especially if he gets rotated to the attack and we're going to face him in, on the defensive end, but hopefully we can uh, lock him down. Um, Kundo's been playing well, such as uh, Carvajal at the moment, so hopefully, yeah, they'll lock him down. Hopefully the defense will, won't let him through. Now... Got a bit of an interesting team at the moment. Um, are we going to be... What's going on with Gabby Jesus? Is he going to be in the club? Or is he going to stay out? Well, we're looking to sign him soon. We're just finalising the deal for his uh, weekly contract at the moment. Um, hopefully, it all goes well. Um, especially the agreement with these bonuses and with these uh, previous club as well. All right. Thanks for your time. Thank you. All right, so I'm here with uh, the manager for uh, your gone, mate. How's the uh, how's the team going at the moment, and uh, what can you expect from this uh, upcoming game? Uh, look, hopefully, you know, I'm feeling confident over the, for what we've done, the work that we've put in over the preseason. Um, you know, we made a few different signings. You know, we're getting a lot of youth coming through the team, but we'll see how we go. We're going to show it out in the performance, but going off training, and you know how. We've been trying to implement new strategies, new tactics, some tactical master classes in there as well in pre-season games. <laughs> um, yeah, nah, should be good. All right, um, I've seen you got a few new signings here. How is uh, Paul Pogba coming along with the team? Yeah, Paul, he's he's done all right since he's come in. Um, first week, you know, the first few games that he's played really made an impact on that midfield. I personally, I didn't think he'd be quick enough around midfield but he has turned out to be a very wonderful signing um, and then you got Wilson in there as well helping out with Kostic um, Kozzi so <laughs> yeah uh, no nah, he's doing really well for the boys um, yeah that's pretty much all I've got on Paul and uh, your defense you a few new signings here such as Saliba, Militao, Mendy and uh, Courtois 
since then. Sorry, what was that? A few new defensive signings, such as Saliba Militao Mendy. Sorry, I don't speak English. <laughs> nah. No. Um, yeah, so a couple of new signings, like I was saying with Paul. You know, they've all made an impact. It's a very complete different team from what we saw last year. Hopefully the supporters, you know, can enjoy what we've done. We've tried to put all the money and spent the good money to get them in. Um, so I just got to hope their performances on the field can back it up. All right, and last question. From the Derby, what are you expecting the uh, goal differential to be? Um, anything can happen on the day, mate. Um, you know, we've had those twists and turns. Those wind streaks get broken by five at the back. Um, yeah. So I'm expecting us to win, or I'm confident we'll win, but you know, we just have to rock up on the day. Hopefully the supporters are there. Hopefully it's a night game, not an afternoon game, because um, you know we can't pick the time, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, see if the opposition can do it in a cold, frosty night in Stoke. That's the main thing. All right, thank you, that's all. Thank you. Thank you. All right, you ready, man? Oh, this is interesting. I've got a, the attacks balanced. My midfield's better and your defense is better. All right, come on, lads. Let's go. Let's win this game. Let's start well. Start well, lads. Yeah. <coughs> Make sure you get copyrighted for that. Oh, well, I don't care. <laughs> the boys need it. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Alright, nah, alright. Let's go. Come on, come on boys, let's start well. This is it, round one, 50k on the line here. Run your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Come on boys, don't start, you know, this duo of Benzema and Haaland. Oh, good tackle. Oh, bro, looky, you're up to your old tricks too. You're still doing it, even in this game. Well, I'm Mendy. Ah, uh, Rashford, that was weak. Come on. Uh, I'm gonna have to. I have to switch in. Oh, look at that false view again. Oh, save Courtois. Oh my god. Benzema. Casemiro has eyes for goal. And a Far out. They lead by two now. <sighs> Gary, beautiful Casemiro. Come so on, oh, boys. Should have played a game before I played you. I want to hear the excuses. Alright. Yes, oh, Cahill, what well on? Here we go. How did Courtois not grab that? Hold on, 2 1. Nice, boys. Keep it up. Yep, force you again. How is that a foul? Oh, on the ball. Oh, it's mine. What? How is that a. <laughs> okay. Bro, I, I honestly don't understand some of the time. Good. Nice. Nice. Mendy. Here we go. Oh, if it was Cahill, he would have gone under that. Get him, Quadrado. How did he lose bending. the ball there? Oh no. Mane. Go for the invoice. Go, Mane! Go, Mane! Show him the Mane! Oh! Good, good pressure. The high press was Not a good pass. Him. No! Oh, I blew that Jesus heavily! Christ. Far out! 
Well, from that range, he should oh, I did it again, man. I shoot where the goalkeeper is. I do it all the time. I always think they're going to go the other way and then lose balance. How have you still got that? How has that gotten through, seriously? Harlem is just built different. Still can't score any other different goal. Ah, uh, yeah. What do you mean? I scored the power shot with Casemiro. Oh, yeah. That's just, that's just, that's just the replacement for the finesse shot. All good. Rashford couldn't keep it. Holland. Holland. Oh my God. Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Uh, um, I'll think about. I don't know how I'm going to list up. Got a few players with different price ranges. <laughs> well done, boys. Well underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating. Back to the learner's manual. And Bernardo. Shoot Bernardo. Sells for Bernardo Silva. Oh, what a save. Alright, I need to make subs. Already, it's only the 48th minute. Yeah, all good, dude. All good. Ah, oh, bugger off. Gurgis. Oh, right here. Oh, oh, my. Oh, my. Wow. Yeah, was, yeah like, seriously, how's yeah, Paul's fine? Oh, my. Thank you, Paul's Oh, thank you, Mendy. Oh, what are you doing, Kale? I just scored that. Oh, you're kidding, yeah, Rat. No, that was a foul. No, it was not. You pushed him. Your player is just weak. Far oh, out. Oh, my God. What? Oh, my. I thought he was pointing to a penalty then. Come on! I see you. Still looking for space. Oh, oh no! Oh yeah. my God! Sorry, that did not deserve to be a goal. Huh? <laughs> Funny that. Oh my! Come on! Ah, oh, freaking hell! And just five minutes remaining. How? Promising looking ball. Oh, wow. Well. Will it be? There's the goal. Surely not. Well. Is that? Well, if there were any lingering doubts. 
doubts about the outcome. Surely they now have been removed. Ah, oh, that's just shit. Good vision from Gabriel Jesus. Oh. High echelon goalkeeping there. <sighs> And he's fired over the corner. And the danger's still on. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Well, that is how to play advantage. Can they convert? Oh, well. Wow. been missed. No other way to describe it. Alright, I'll see who, I, who I've got to put in, in the club on the market. Thank you very much. As you can tell by this series, people, you know who's going to be the better player. So, you know the betting odds there? Mate, it was the first game with the team and first game on today. You've been playing all day, bro. I've had I've played three games today. today. This has been my third. Oh, yeah. <coughs> well and truly mm. deserve to win that. I'll take your questions. What was your assessment of the game today? Ah, fabulous performance from the boys. Uh, dominated. Um, the uh, scoreboard, I mean, five-two win victory against the rivals is a uh, pretty, pretty great, outstanding uh, performance. Um, stats uh, did look si a bit similar, I will say, but we just outclassed them. First half was really strong. You guys started off with four goals in the first half. What was the mentality at half time? Uh, half time, I, I was just saying to the boys, keep keep the flow, keep the flow. You know, we did score another goal in that second half, but conceded two. We did we did in the end lose the first half in goals, but ultimately we came out on top, and I'm really happy with the boys. You know, you guys started really strong. The opposition were trying to get back into the game, um, and there was a lot of build up start of the week what was kind of the mentality before the game obviously well executed in the first half what was the mentality going into the match oh prior to um this rival rivals game uh we did end up going on a streak a seven game winning streak of the boys and they were performing like mad harland was just the complete finisher so it was benzema the whole squad even the defense um oh was just playing unstoppable. Casimir, the team captain, really stepped up as well during the game, especially. Um, that's why he's wearing the captain's armband. Now, what special tactics have we? did we try and interpretate onto the opposition today to really shut their game down? Yeah, so um, we played uh, good pressure. Good pressure. I told the boys to play pressure you know, during the game. Um, yeah, we just pressured them. Uh, there's a few um, info, a few formation changes too. There was a one from the four two three one to the four triple two, um, which really helped us a lot, especially in its dual striker formation. Um, which yeah, uh, at the end of the day, won us the game. And for last but not least, what are we going to be spending the fifty thousand coins on? Um, not too sure yet. Uh, looking at a few signings, but uh, looking at yeah, like. Probably uh, Alan Shearer of some sort, maybe. But at the moment, the team's just magnificent. Performance is out of the room. Um, like, I, I've got no one to really sign to. No worries. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So, Connor, um, the derby that happened, uh, how the, how's the team performance in that upsetting loss? <sighs> Not really have any comments to be honest. It was just a terrible performance. Um, if you check by the stats of the game, it was actually pretty well even. Obviously, we we're down in the possession, but you know the shots and the the shots that were taken on target were pretty good. Um, obviously, just didn't get the right opportunities. Uh, just the flow of the game wasn't going our way. You know, we started we started all right. We got we got a goal early. Um, just after that, just fell away. The defense held up. Even though we conceded five goals, the defense did hold up not so bad. It's just outside of the defense, we just got under the pump too early and just couldn't hold them out long enough. Okay, and uh, how's what you know? What's the debut to the players like Mane and Cahill? What did you think 
Uh, not great. Um, not not the dream performance that we were kind of hoping in the first week, but you know, there's always room for improvement. They're going to be with us for a long time, so just got to see how we go. And uh, what's the uh, you know what's the rule to improvement for the next derby game? Uh, um, really, it's just uh, try and hold more of the ball. I I feel that you know in terms of the it's just the build up play that we need to really work on. Um, the execution. Most most parts it's been okay, but yeah, just the execution and holding more of the possession, that's really the main two for me. And during the game, was there any key performances that uh, you sought out during that game, or was it just all around upsetting? Uh, for, my, for my squad or yours? For your squad. Um, it wasn't really a standout performance. Everyone, you know, we're all one as a team. Um, didn't really start well. In terms of, you know, we started okay, but we didn't consistently do that. And then just the second half came, and we were just way too far behind to come back into the match. So that's really it. I've, all I've got for there. Um, in terms of performances for next week, I don't know who's going to come in and who's going to go out, but we'll, we'll just have to say there's going to be some changes, that's for sure. Awesome. Thank you. Thanks. <clears throat> Thanks for watching the video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed our first game this this year in FIFA 23. Um, Jacob's obviously come out on top pretty comfortably. So hopefully you enjoyed it. And if you have any comments or potential video ideas on what we can do for games, like our special game a week, please leave them in the comments below. And we will be happily, more than happy to try them out. So thank you and enjoy your day. And we will see you next week.